Welcome to Chef Pachi's Journey with Flavors. On seasoning protein. Seasoning your protein after portioning and before storing takes you one step ahead in your cooking. When you remove a piece of seasoned meat, poultry, game, or seafood from the freezer or refrigerator, you don't have to think what to do with it. Simply bake it or grill it. Making your food delicious on its own and you can still serve it along with a spread or sauce that's been made ahead. Freezing your seasoned meats allows you to have all your meals prepped in one day, even for your whole month. And then you can simply disconnect. Knowing that anything you pick for the day is ready makes cooking easy and enjoyable. Knowing that you can get home and 20 minutes later you're enjoying a complete sit-down meal is like having a restaurant at hand. Avoiding daily questioning on what to eat is priceless. Especially when you know that all your food is healthy and delicious. One day every month you can plan and execute all your meals and then just enjoy them. Red meats are seasoned with herbs, spices and oils. White meats need more tenderizing and I add acidic foods like juice or yogurt instead of oils. This is one of Chef Pachi's hacks, the perfect chicken. Check out how I season the chicken inside the skin. So you can actually bake it with the skin and it'll protect your meat and the flavor will stay inside of your chicken. Never eat a dry white meat with Chef Pachi's hat. Wait, all your food will be delicious and tender. I love to season game with herbs, spices, vegetables, and sometimes fruit. Very fatty meats do not need seasoning ahead and can be pre-prepped if desired. Ribeyes, ribs, salmon and tuna are some. Organizing a week and then doubling it gives you half a month of your favorite meals. If you think it'll be too repetitious, just go for two weeks and then you'll have a month and so on. Simply add the veggies and the carb you want to your meals. We will talk about cooking for multiple meals on veggies and carbs too. Divide and conquer your meal conundrum. I will include a link to the complete chart on seasoning. Seafood is definitely the easiest of all the meats to season. Just an herb, olive oil, and you're done. The week has seven days. For meat eaters, we can have two days of beef, two days of poultry, two days of seafood, and one day of game, for example. If it gives you trouble to think, what am I going to do with beef this week? I'll just do burgers and then I don't know what? Click on the link that I have on, on meal ideas. And there, you're going to have a chart for each one of your foods. Beef, pork, fish, salmon, tuna, lentils, cannellini beans, all of that. It'll be really easy with just a look to remember what foods you like and what you want to make. Chef Pachi!
for vegan meals, plant-based or plant-enhanced meals, we can have a day of black beans, a day of lentils, a day of cannellini beans, a day of red beans, a day of tofu, a day of seitan, and a day of tempeh. Edamame, chickpeas, refried beans, and soy milk will be complementing other meals. Preparing your legumes and freezing them in portion sizes is incredibly productive. One pound of vegan chili makes 12 meals. One pound of cannellini and portobellos also makes 12 meals. And so on. You can have all those meals prepped ahead with Chef Pachi Hacks. Remember, with Chef Pachi, delicious diets are sustainable diets. Enjoy!